working your your lats and your back your back is an extremely important part of beach volleyball so lots of different exercises you can do for that one is once again going into a deep wide stance flattening out your back get the weight down by your your hip and pull that weight up but while you're doing it look at the weight the reason you want to look at the weight is so you can get your core to turn so we can go the, this exercise from here watching the weight we can pull the weight out in front of us watch the weight all the way back or we can push the weight all the way uh, with our arms straight out watch that weight come back Getting used to getting your body to turn while, you're, while you have weights in your hands is very beneficial in terms of exercise for beach volleyball. When you're doing exercises off a bench, make sure you get at least one leg off the ground while you're doing the exercise, if not two. So if you're doing a pull down, get one leg up off the ground when you pull down. You won't be able to pull as much weight but it will engage your core. If you can, get both legs off the ground to pull down. Or when you're doing bench presses, get your legs up. Press with your legs up. Even go into a bicycle when you're, when you're doing a, a press. When you're doing flies, legs up. At least one leg up. Now, remember, you won't be able to do near as much weight as you normally would if your feet were planted in the ground. But we're not training to be weightlifters. We're training to be beach volleyball players. So engage your core while you're doing the exercises by lifting one or two legs up off the ground. Push-ups are a great exercise for your upper body, shoulders, back, and also your stomach, your core area make them even a little bit more difficult by using balance so once you're in a regular push-up position and you go down and up bring one leg up over your shoulder and look at it so now you got core rotation and balance going along with a push-up even if you're only able to do push-ups off your knees to start with you can do the same thing you off your knees you go through the push-up you bring one knee up and look at it. Turn your body back, do the push-up. You'll get strong enough in a very short period of time to be able to do it off your feet. Nice flat back, go through the push-up motion. Turn your body, look at your knee, come back down, do the push-up.